Hello, everyone. So in this video, we're going to take a look at uh, just-in-time privilege capabilities that are available in Manage Engine's PAN360 solution. Um, with regards to just-in-time elevation, PAN360 basically offers two uh, methods of elevation. First would be local elevation, where an account could be automatically elevated into a local admin group or a, a local security group of a member server. And the second option is where you can elevate a domain account into respective security groups in Active Directory. Now, for local elevation, PAM360 has the JIT capabilities out of the box. As you may already know, inside PAM360, we have a concept of resources, which denotes a particular endpoint. And uh, you will find two types of endpoints. One is Windows, which represents your Windows servers, uh, workstations, and anything that runs with a, a typical Windows operating system. And then you will find Windows domain, which represents your domain controllers. So this is the actual uh, DC. And inside this, you will have domain accounts listed. Whereas under Windows resources, everything you find will be local accounts, respective to just that box. So that's it. Um, let's look at uh, one of the Windows machines. Um, and there's a local account. And in our previous video, we already covered a little bit on how uh, you could use access control functionality to enforce users to request access before gaining uh, uh, access to a particular server or to a particular password. And this just-in-time feature works kind of similar, where when you configure the access control feature, you will also have the option to uh, uh, configure the security group. So for example, if I go to access control, you will have this option called policy configuration. Now, this is available under Windows Domain Resource, and it will also be available as a, a privilege elevation option for Windows Resource. But the concept is fairly straightforward. You can enable this box that says Elevate Account Privileges by adding into particular security groups. And when you click on Select, it will basically show all the security groups present in Active Directory. Now, for domain, just in time elevation, you need to integrate PAM360 with AD Manager solutions. So AD Manager is our uh, primary Active Directory management solution. So the way PAM elevates users is by talking to AD Manager. So you have a user who logs in and puts a request because they need uh, uh, domain admin rights for 15 minutes. So the request is approved inside PAM, and then PAM talks to AD Manager to automatically elevate that account into the domain admin. So in, in, that, in that same example, so um, let's say I want this user, um, um, uh, Rachel, to be able to elevate their account domain admin whenever required. So I will configure it under access control, policy configuration. And I will say when the user requests and when a proper approving authority approves the request, I would like their account to be added into domain admin groups. So this is just an example. As you can see, there are different groups. You can create your own customized security group with very fine-grained permissions. And that user's account will be elevated into this domain admin groups in real time. So when Rachel logs in, one day Rachel needs access uh, with domain admin rights for 15 minutes. So Rachel will log into PAM, put a request, and when it is approved, uh, Rachel's account will be elevated into domain admin. So this is how the just-in-time privilege elevation capability works um, with uh, Active Directory-based groups. And like I said, for this functionality to work, you will need uh, to integrate PAM360 with AD Manager. And that can be done under Admin, um, Integrations, Manage Engine, and you will find AD Manager's option available here, where you can supply the host name and port number in which your AD Manager solution is running. But if you are just looking for local account elevation, then you could configure it in um, in uh, any machine. So if you take this RDP machine as an example, if I go to a configure access control, I have the same privilege elevation option. And it is basically showing the local groups present in that member server. So to recap, you can automatically elevate shared local accounts into local groups which will work out of the box. Or you can integrate PAM360 with our AD Manager solution, and you can elevate domain user accounts into domain groups when a just-in-time elevation is required. 